Welcome back. We're here looking at the energy market. This is going to be my daily forecast for Tuesday, August 2nd, 2022. If you like support the channel, we're going to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner. Hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos. And the, all my trades and portfolio are available in the link down below. So let's get to it and we'll start by looking at the WTI oil. And as you can see, we are basically falling off a cliff today. We are down more than 5%. We have broken below the 200 moving average. And this is starting to look like a bear market. Uh, recession is a already here or around the corner for most of the world world's economies and therefore demand for oil or energy in general will basically uh, diminish over time so what we're looking at at this current stage is a downtrend in wti oil which is looking something similar to this we were basically at the highs tried to break out on friday and then we just fell off a cliff today we went from probably $101 a barrel down to where we are at this current stage at the $93.5 a barrel and below the 200 moving average. So it kind of looks like we are about to have the 50 moving average, which is moving in this direction, going to cross the 200 moving average that is going to rally in this direction. So, so yes, at this point, we have a golden crossing and it's a signal that we are about to have a market that is in a downtrend. If that happens, the last time we basically had this crossing was way over here. This was in in uh, September in 2020 and uh, we haven't basically been in an uptrend since. So it looks like we are world economy is um, is um, is about to go in recession and therefore demand will um, will decrease and of course price will decrease with demand if you look at technical indicators we can see the macd is uh, bearish still stochastic is bearish and the rsi is bearish as well and with a little room to the downside if we continue in this pattern we may see uh, this market drop towards the lows here and this will be around 85 83 dollars per barrel and would kind of anticipate this to go back up and then go in this in this movement if we are to follow this channel so to the upside if we manage to break above this uh, this um supper trend line then we may go heading towards uh, the 50 moving average but at this current stage it's just bad news over bad news every single day about the world economy and the state of in it in it so let's look at natural gas and natural gas has technically rallied from one point where we kind of expected it. We broke below $8. We went all the way down towards uh, $7.7 and now we have rallied quite significantly. We are, we are up at the $8.1, but it is to be seen whether or not this rally uh, manages to hold. If we look at the technical indicators, we can see that that we did break no oh, that was sorry wrong do that again to the highs we did break below um 38.2 fibonacci retracement but we have the 50 moving average right around this area but we kind of bounced from that area there i would expect this to test the 50 moving average that is down here at 7.4 dollars 50 um Fibonacci retracement is at uh, $7.4, and after that, it's down towards the 61.8, which is at $6.9. Uh, but as we've seen, this market is extremely volatile, and it's nearly every single day that there is news about cuts in Europe, this is supply to Europe, and so on, which basically makes this market basically uh, go um, parabolical. If you look at technical indicators, otherwise, we can see the MACD is still uh, bullish, stochastic is bearish, and RSI is bearish as well. So, hope you found this helpful. If you want to support your channel by subscribing, hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos. And good luck, and thank you very much.